Okay, I think I'm just going to have to trust that this is recording. Hopefully it's not fuzzy. It looks fuzzy on my screen. Maybe it's just my screen. Uh, I hope I am recording. Okay. Hello my fellow weirdos and welcome to another video. Um, I'm going to be reviewing the kits today. I'm going to try to call them kits instead of packs because I tend to call everything packs and I don't know why. Sorry if I'm bopping around. There's something reflecting in my window. Oh, it's the ghost. No, I don't know what it is. It's something purple and I can see it in... Oh, it's the ghost's eyes. I see. They reflect purple in my thing. Are they like changing colors? Yes, they are changing colors. Cool. So yeah, that's my new ghost, by the way, from Pac-Man, in case you haven't seen it. Also, new antenna bopper things. I've been obsessed with peeps lately and I saw these peeps headbands. I already have two, but I decided to get these anyway because they were like 50 cents. Why not? <laughs> anyway. Um, today we are going to be reviewing the, um, is this daytime? Afternoon, yeah, let's go to afternoon. We're going to do the garden pack first because I know I'm going to love the basement or treasure pack. I don't even know what they're called. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, um, we're going to be reviewing the kits. See, I called them packs again. By the way, my name is Flower the Weirdo. If you don't know me, I want to say hello and welcome to my channel if you're new here. If you are a returning weirdo, thank you for continuing to support me. And don't forget to um, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this one. Hold on, itchy nose. Allergy season. Um, anyway, let's get right down to it. This is the gardening pack, I believe. Can I sort by kits now? Because I have better build buy in here. Boo, 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 boo. Greenhouse Haven is what it's called. Um, so when I, for the past couple of days, for the past like four days, I have been working on my Instagram RP account, which is, um, Tristan, who was in a Big Brother episode by that Plumba Rob. Um, anyway, you can follow him on, Tri on Tristan. <laughs> on Instagram, it's I am Tris Hendricks. I am underscore, I'm underscore Tris Hendricks. I don't know. Anyway, um, one of my friends who also does RP on Instagram, the Mom Cave or TMC Creative, wanted some poses from me. So I took some time out to make these poses. And while I was gone, it was only like two days or three days. And I come back and there's two kits available or soon to be available and an update. And I'm just like, whoa, how long was I gone for? Anyway, um, let's go ahead. It doesn't seem like a whole lot of these items, which is fine. I'm, I'll do build build items too. Um, but we'll start with these. There's a nice little shelf area. This is cool. Um, we can probably put things on it, I guess. I don't even know how to work this. I haven't played The Sims in so long. I've been concentrating on storytelling lately and pose making. Uh, in case you haven't checked me out, I am on CurseForge now. If you want to download some stuff from there to help support me, that would be awesome. This is a wall shelf. Uh, let's get a wall in here real quick. Um, I would give you my CurseForge thing, but um, I'm not exactly sure if it's flower underscore the underscore weirdo or flower dash the dash weirdo, but I'm pretty sure it's not flower the weirdo because for some reason I don't think I could have got, I don't think I could get that. But anyways, I will put a link in the description below to both the, my Instagram, or all three of my Instagram stories, and my Curse Forge. Okay, so that's a really cool shelf. I know I'm just blah blah blahing and not actually looking at the items. <gasps> this is cute. Ooh, I like this. Look at how it's got little like gloves coming out of it. And it's got tools hanging, a trowel, and on this side it's got a rake and a brush. This is so cute. Little lock box down here. A watering can. How fun. Can you? Yeah, you can. Oh, these are starter seedlings. Do they actually, like, you're growing a plant. I think, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know if these are gameplay items. I don't think they are. I think they're just decorations. Um, but let's see what, um, oh, so these, wait, these, why are they all, oh, because they're new. I was like, why do they have, like, lock stuff around them? It's not locking, it's just new. Am I recording? Thank goodness. So, it's mainly just the different colors of the pot, which is cool. Oh, that one, like, it's just started. And that's another one that's just started. Oh, it's so cute. 
How cute! And those ones don't go on a table, they just go on the ground. I'm assuming they have all the same pot colors. So yeah, that's so cute. I like those. And then there's a miniature vine, which actually, I'm going to tell you a secret. Um, I love plants, but these ones like this that grow scare me really badly. I don't know if I used to have nightmares or something that they would come and like wrap around my ankles, but they really scare me when they grow off to the side. So like grapevines and um, those kind of plants. We have one downstairs and we didn't... Um, we weren't taking care of it a lot, so instead of like growing up, it was just kind of growing in a ball. And when we stretched it out, it went like all the way across the kitchen. We're like, oh, so now we have it like spread across the kitchen. And I'm just like, oh, it's so creepy. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and look at, so this just changes the pot colors. It would be neat if it changed the top colors too. Um, so that's what I'm looking at right now. So we're going to do the blooming basket. I love these. I would love to to have more in the game because I like to put these on the outside of the houses that I built. Ah! Uh, oh, I was gonna say the reason I'm doing this pack first, if I didn't say it already, I'm pretty sure I did, but I'm kind of biased to like grungy stuff so I figured I would do this pack first because when I see all the grungy stuff I'm just gonna be so excited and it's just gonna be, um, you know, I'm just going to love pretty much everything. Because <laughs> I like to build abandoned houses. So in case you didn't know, I, that's one of my favorite things to do is to decorate abandoned houses. This is cute. Little water squirty fertilizer -y things. I like to make up words too. <gasps> Ooh, pretty colors. Look at how pretty. Oh, I like those. Those are cute. And I love this. This just reminds me of, um, I don't know, our school would give away like these little things for us to grow. And mine would always die because I'm really bad at taking care of plants. My mom's better, so she takes care of the plants. I just pick which ones I like. and She, she takes care of them. Uh, let's see. More pots. I love all these pots. Sorry, I got a message over there telling me I have... 967 megabytes of junk cluttering my PC. Great, thank you. Like, I don't know that. Alright, um, ooh, these pots are cute. I like that one. Um, we have, like, piles and piles of pots everywhere. The gardener's hall, which I assume can't go on a table. You know, I should move these things. So, um, the slots aren't full. Oh, it does go on the table, too. Cool. Let's keep throwing everything on the floor. Oh, you know what? I also said I would get rid of the grid. And I didn't. Because I know the grid can be very annoying. Especially in these type of videos. So these are cool. It looks like it's the same. I like that. Um, it looks like the bin is kind of really metallic looking. But I like that um, they kind of match. You know, they're a little matchy matchy. I don't know if that's what I was saying. I don't know. Like I said, it's been so long since I've recorded a video. It's, I almost, I'm forgetting what I'm doing here. So the mulch thing can go on the table too, which is awesome. Uh, let's see what, there's only a couple. Oh, it's like chicken feed. And this one is just a random bag. And this one is flower seeds. So it's like each one is something different. Vegetables, chicken feed, poop, and flowers. And, oh, I love this. This is so cool. This would be awesome for, like, industrial builds and stuff. And to put in your attic. Can you, um... No. It's like a window, so you can't size it down. That's sad. Or you could size it down, maybe, and put another window around it? I don't know. But, yeah. I like that. I like that a lot. <sighs> I have been wanting these for ever oh i'm so excited about the green gable like mm, i've just been wanting like different kinds of things to put up in the gables like the scroll work things on um victorian houses especially because i love building victorian houses so that would be awesome this is nice too 
but I would love the Victorian house one. This is a solar light. Oh, it's it's on the wall. That's cool. That's cool. Uh, 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 that's really cool. Okay, so I'm wondering if this is a storage chest, which personally, I hardly ever use storage chests in the game. But um, when I was playing with the Strange Family, which if you know me, you know I talk about the Strange Family all the time, but you hardly ever see them because they're my off-screen family. I'm thinking about doing like a some kind of let's play involving them but one of the things I was trying to do was collect all the collectibles but I didn't want to get rid of them like I wanted to have them all so I would store them in the chest which was fun and I think that's it for this so let's go ahead and see because I know there's some build items uh no roofs oh this greenhouse glass roof okay so let's build um a room Okay, and I think there's probably windows too. Yes, excellent. This is one of my favorite things to do in my rags to riches when they get enough money is to make a greenhouse like this. I probably should make this room a little bit smaller so I don't have to fill it with so many windows. There, I make it smaller this way. We'll just make a teeny tiny little greenhouse. Let's, let's do, uh, let's, let's have my game freeze while I'm recording a video. That's awesome. We'll do one of each color. No, I'm pretty sure I clicked that. Oh, that's cool. It has like the, um, the bubbly texture inside the window. Oh, that's cool too. These are so cool. There's another one. Is that bubbles or is that wire? That might be wire. I can't tell. I can't tell if it's the bubbles or the wire. Wait, um... Yeah, it doesn't really say what it is. But I love these ones with the trellis in it, I guess. I know I could probably do some of the other window too, but whatever. We're just doing this window. We're just doing this one. Now I don't have to use the mosquito pack windows like I always do. I can use this window. It would be nice if they had like a long window. So they don't have any tall windows. I know somebody was asking if it works on curved walls, which would be cool. But to tell you the truth, I have not played with curved walls. That's how long it's been since I've built something. I did some renovation, but I haven't really built any houses. And the one that I did build, um, I gotta get that speed build out. But the one that I did build didn't have any curved walls because I usually do it from um, floor plans, so. Wow, this looks so cute with all these, like, pots laying around. Anyway, yeah, I did it, uh, I use floor plans and they hardly ever have any curved walls in them. So what is this now? This is just a greenhouse wall. Does it come in, it does come in other colors. Is that, I think that's like Adobe painted green. I don't think it's, oh, that's cool. That'd be nice for, like, siding. Brown. I don't know why I have to go all the way across with them. There's some more, uh, I don't know if it's called Adobe or not. Plaster. Not sure what that is. I don't know the names for things. I don't know words. I like the green. Green's nice. Green's one of my favorite colors. Black. So it's basically the same thing, just in different, uh, colors and stuff. So that's cool. Uh, we need to go here. Oh, this is awesome! I love this. Oh, this is so cool. Look at how cool that is. Oh, I like that. What about this? Oh, that one. I like these ones with like the lines and the bricks. I think that looks so neat. It's such a cool like design in it. I don't know. I love this. I just love it so much. This would be perfect for like backyard patios and greenhouses but you know what I mean it's like it's like perfect for that okay so what is, there's nothing there fences any fences found no results columns spandrels stairs no stairs uh I mean technically we could put that down but oh I must have deleted something and got rid of all of those ah uh, uh, that might be everything. There's nothing in roofs. What about in... Let me just click every little thing here. I mean, it is a kit. I don't know why I'm expecting, like, more items. I could have sworn there was a roof. 
Oh yeah, but I thought there was a different roof texture too, but maybe, maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. How do I make a roof again? Haha, that is how I make a roof. So yeah, I was just going to do some, um, just my two review videos, but I came up with an idea for a Let's Play and now I want to do it. Because, you know, I have to start five, 500 Let's Plays. These are very cool. I like these a lot. I almost want to go to my botanical garden build and give it this. This would have been perfect for that. It's on my YouTube channel if you want to check that out. It was for a... A spring contest, I think last year? 2022, is that when I had my nose surgery? I can't remember. My sinus surgery, not my nose surgery. Um, I mean, I guess it was, it was a deviated septum, so it was nose and sinus. God, this fan is so awesome. I love this fan. But I think we've pretty much, let me put the filter back on. Yeah, I think we've pretty much covered everything water features there's nothing in any of that what about um ground textures is there anything in that no yeah so i think that's everything but anyway this is very very cool um i like this a lot i liked it more than i thought i would even though it's just the clutter it's not i was hoping there'd be more like different plants to actually plant with let's see what this room looks like Ooh, it's big Oh, this is so cute. How's the roof look? Oh no, I make my own roof. Oh, I didn't look at doors. The da doors So it's just like the regular... Oh, it's right there. <laughs> okay. Um, I want to see what the door... Oh, stop moving around. I just want to see the different swatches on the door. Yeah. I was wondering if they had the bubbly texture windows. It kind of doesn't look... Oh wait, that one is. Yeah. Like I said, I don't know if that's bubble or screen, but either way, it it works. Because it makes it kind of not so see-through. But yeah. Yeah. I like that. I like it. Alright. We don't really need to see all of them. Anyway, I think that is everything in this kit. I keep wanting to say pack, but kit. What is on the shelf here? Do they just have seed packets in here? This is so cute. It's just regular starter fruits. Cute. Let's do half up and half down. And go down a level. There we go. So we can see inside. This is so cute. I really need to get back into building. I miss building. I miss it a lot. Building is what I started with. I was a speed a speed builder <laughs> before I started doing Let's Plays. I made speed build. Um, but I pretty much wear many, many hats, both literally and figuratively. Um, if you could, if you consider these hats, I do wear hat hats too. Anyways, if you like this video, please click the like button and subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this one. And remember to always stay weird because weirdos roll. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time. And I think the next one is the basement kit, which I'm super excited about because grunge. Yes. Abandoned houses. Woohoo. And also in that kit, there is a TV that I used to have in my childhood home and I've been trying to recreate my childhood home. And so that would be perfect for it. Anyway, I will let you go. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Hi!